Hi, I'm Eric Coyle. I'm going to show you how to create a comparison analysis using a data tool called On The Map. You will be able to generate results showing the count and characteristics of workers living or employed in your selected area. Let me show you how it works. Once in the On The Map tool, it's really easy to begin your area comparison analysis by simply typing in the geography of choice within the search bar. You can narrow that search by using any of the geographies listed in the drop down menu. For this example, I'm going to go ahead and type in Clark, and then I'm going to narrow my search to counties and click search. And now I'm only going to see a list of counties referencing the word Clark. So here I'm going to now select Clark County, Nevada. And here you can see the map is now zoomed into the geographic area that I've selected, which is Clark County, Nevada. Now I can quickly perform an analysis on my selected area by clicking on the link in the pop-up window, which will then allow me to select whether I want to first look at where employees live or where employees work. I'm going to go ahead and leave it on where employees work. The analysis type selection will allow me to go ahead and select my area comparison and decide which areas within the county I want to visualize. Here I can use the drop down menu to select only those geographies that are smaller than the selection area. Since our selection area is a county, I can select places within the county for comparison. You can also look at which segment of the labor market you'd like to look at. So you can either select all workers, which is the default, or make another selection based on the variables provided in the drop-down list. I'm going to leave it at all workers. Here we can then choose to select multiple years or simply look at one year, which is the default. And for the job type, I can also make other selections other than the defaulted private primary jobs. To know what each one of these represents, either by the homework area, the analysis type, the year or the job type, simply hover your mouse over the question mark. So now I'm just going to click go based on my selected criteria. And then my area comparison analysis will be produced displaying by default the top 10 cities by job counts in Clark County, which was my primary geographic selection. I can further zoom into my map using the zoom in feature here on the top left of the map. And where I have my number of results showing the top 10, I can change that to top 25. And if I zoom out, I'll get a thematic overlay of exactly those cities and towns within Clark County. Additionally, in my chart to the right, I will be able to look at the data visualized in a bar chart, as well as provided in a list at the bottom of the chart. The features on the map control are similar to those that are provided in other types of analysis, minus some that would feature the point overlay. The comparison analysis only allows for a thematic overlay. Other features still remain, which include a detailed report, export geography, and the ability to print the chart and map. The legend will tell you number of jobs from the lightest shade to the darkest. And that's how easy it is to create a comparison analysis by cities and towns within a county. Of course, you can choose which geographies you'd like to compare that are available within the tool. I hope you find On The Map useful. To learn how to create a distance and direction analysis of your labor market, check out our next On The Map data gem at census.gov academy. And don't forget to subscribe.